Well, you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be looking at how we can create our own expanding dynamic uh, virtual hard disk inside Windows 10 now you can do this also in other versions of Windows but we're going to be using Windows 10 for this to do our expanding uh, dynamic hard drive so what we're going to do here is to set this up we're going to come down to the start button and right click on that start button and uh, we want to then go to where it says disk management click on that and then this window will open up here I'll just open this up so you can see a little bit better so you can see here we've got our machine set up here we've got our C drive we can click on our C drive here and you should see the uh, diagonal lines here once we've done that we can come up to where it says action and then we're going to create a VHD Now you want to select the location where you want to put your uh, virtual hard disk. So we're going to select browse. And uh, we're just going to leave ours on our desktop for here, but you should put it somewhere a little bit more better than that. But we're just going to stick ours on the desktop and you can see you could just use the uh, side panel here to navigate where you want to go to. So we're just going to call this one test just like so and click save. And now you can see the path is selected to save the test VHD onto our desktop. Now the virtual disk uh, hard disk size is here and you can use the drop down tab here to select what you want megabytes, gigabytes or terabytes depending on how much you want to use. So we're going to use just megabytes here just for this video and I'm going to select say 300. Now what we want to do here is we want to select the VHD X this supports uh, virtual disks lar larger than 2040 gigabytes in size. We also want to make sure that we are dynamically uh, expanding and this is going to allow us to uh, every time we add files to that drive it's going to grow in maximum size i.e. expand and this is what this is, it's, it's an expanding hard disk basically and this is what we're going to be using. Click OK now you can see we have 300 megabytes you can make yours as big as you like now on the left hand side here you should see uh, whatever disk yours is saved just click on this it says unknown we want to right click on this area and click initialize disk this is now gonna give you an option of having MBR master boot record or GPT we're gonna select the GPT offering here and click OK okay now that's done what we're going to do next is right click on here and create a new simple volume and we can go through the motions here it's going to sign the following letter you can, if you want to select your own letter you can do here but we're just going to leave that as is so then we need to go next here now you can name the volume what you like we're going to just name this uh, test and you can also enable file and folder compression if you want to we're just going to leave this off and perform a quick uh, format here click finish and let that finish the process once, that, once that's done you should now see the drive is on your desktop and you can access that drive as you can see just like any other drive and put all your files and data into that drive and remember this is an expanding dynamic uh, virtual uh, drive as well as you can see and you can store this wherever you like but as you can see this is on our desktop and that's basically how you can uh, create your own dynamically extra uh, expanding virtual hard disk inside Windows 10 but you can also use this in other operating systems as well and you can see it being listed here in blue so I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, then hit that like button. It really does help me out. Also, hit the subscribe button if you want to get notified when I upload new videos. If you've got any problems with your computers or you've got any questions or any sort of video requests, you can head over to my forums. The information is on the screen. 
right now if you haven't joined my Facebook fan page you can also do that it's a simple process of just liking my Facebook fan page and you become a member over there okay so thanks again and thanks for your support bye for now